that. In Windows 7, if you want to create a VPN connection, a Windows VPN connection, just go on to the control panel and then click on the network and sharing center. And from here, we're going to set up a new connection to a network. Choose the connect to a workplace option. Click next. Go ahead and say we're going to create a new connection. Click on the use my internet connection VPN and from here we will set up an address we can also use a DNS name and from here we'll call it new VPN and you can also check the box to allow other people to use this connection if other people log into the computer and if you're not ready to connect yet then check the box that says don't connect now just set it up and here we'll put in our username and our password and from here we can show the characters if we want and if anybody's looking over your shoulder definitely don't check that box click the remember this password in most cases you don't have to put in the domain click create and close and now we'll go back into connection, click change adapter settings, we're going to click on new VPN and choose properties and we're going to want to change a few more things here. First is the type of security. We're going to want to change that to the type of security it is, in this case a PPTP VPN. The reason for that is because it will connect faster if it doesn't have to go through all the different protocols. On networking, we're going to want to double click on the version 4 of TCPIP. Click Advanced. You want to uncheck the Use Default Gateway on Remote Network. That way, your internet traffic can go out one direction and your VPN traffic can go through this connection. Otherwise, you will slow down your VPN tremendously. From here, you can add the internal DNS server at the other location that you're trying to connect to and you also want to append the DNS suffixes. That way if you're looking for a server by its first name it will automatically append the Windows Active Directory after that. And now that that's connected you can go ahead and connect and you're all set.